do a little bit to walk in here for losing the overtime, but yeah, you take away the, the three and three rough game last night, you're not getting five out of six points. Uh, and can you still take away the positives here from this weekend? Yeah, like you said, it uh, stings a little bit. It's just myself, so I kind of don't want to play at the end there. So, um, so we got to learn from my mistakes. Kind of let uh, hack it down and play the awesome tonight. Um, and they tracks these are better than ever. It, it seemed like with, with the goals that went in, a couple, you know, tips and takes here or there, but uh, you know, having the goaltending, it really kept in so you get that shot significantly. Uh, like you said, I mean, was that a product of just playing for the third day or? Uh, I mean, three games and three nights does take a toll on you. Guys were a little tired coming in today, and obviously we're as well. We're trying to get that out of the game right now. And, um, because, uh, yeah, again, the Cavs played on. He has been playing great for us, and uh, I always just has some bad luck right now. And um, he works hard in practice, and he's he's really uh, really trying to help the team out. He puts a lot of pressure on himself, but uh, hopefully we can get him a win. Was it energizing at all during the second period when you guys got that extended power play? I mean, I know, you know, having, having the math unit out there for that one of time kind of tiring, but is that something that gives you guys a little hope yeah. almost? Uh, you know, it, we have our part of it is awesome. Do you think teams know that they can't take a pound like that? Um, they're going to, especially our first unit, they're going to capitalize on, on those. And uh, at the same time, though, when you look at a 3-3, three and three, uh, six minutes with those with your, your top guys on the ice, it drains them a little bit. So um, that could have been a factor. But, um, yeah. He's been uh, playing with Army a lot. He might be his first 3-3, three three, I think. He can't be three before. But uh, anyway, I mean, it seems like his game... He got another assist tonight. It seems like it's really been coming along. You kind of have a hard time seeing for that. What have you seen? Um, you know what? It, it took him a little bit uh, to get used to the North American style. There's not as much time out there. And, um, he's got like great hands. He's very good skills, I believe. Um, uh, and then again, it's just, just a matter of getting to know your line mates and um, you know, making sure that he has his space to do his thing and uh, get open. Uh, at the same time, he's he's improved with. with with uh, cause many turnovers and uh, making sure he's hard on the puck and, and, and the, the score check has gotten a lot better too. There was a sorry, there was a time in the second period where he score checked back behind the play and created a lot of offensive zone time. And normally, I think he would get pushed off the puck a little bit there or just kind of give up and, and go the other way. That's a product of him just figuring out how it needs to be done here. Yeah, yeah, ex exactly. Um, he's been he's been a lot harder on Fox. And again, it's just practicing the right, American style of game. I mean, um, when we were over at the Spangler Cup, we, we gave the teams a lot of a lot of time and space because we weren't used to it. We gave them a lot of Fox, and, and that's what he's used to. And uh, I mean, it's, it's, it's been showing. His game's been improving a lot since, uh, especially over the last month. Yeah.